Recently, I had a chance to go to the launch pad, thanks to Andrew Hazen and his wonderful team over there, and I met these wonderful, young, fantastic entrepreneurs. They are Noelle and Callie, and they are with Impish Lee. Hello. Hello. <laughs> so it was pitch night. Yeah. And, and um, I should say that you're young entrepreneurs, but actually you've been in business for a while, but yeah. then you started Impish Lee. Yeah. Okay, so tell us about your brand and how it began. So Noelle started making lingerie as a hobby, and I helped her photograph it because I'm a photographer. And we started a little Etsy shop once we knew that her designs were likable, and we started to um, sell on Etsy, and then it all just developed and spiraled from there. And that was about five years ago, yeah. and we just recently launched our own website a year and a half ago. Congratulations. Yeah. And so the things about um, your intimates that are different than what you could buy at the store are what? What are some of the big um, selling sure. features that your brand has? Well, we are actually a customizable intimate apparel brand. Okay. What that means is that um, women can come onto our website and they can design their own lingerie and loungewear to, to fit them perfectly, their shape, their fabrics, everything, so that they have a unique garment that's made just for them. And a lot of times, whether it's something that you're just wearing on, a, on its own or you're wearing something under other garments, it's the foundation that's most important, right. right? You want something that's comfortable, that fits well, that has long wear, that's quality. And I know that those are some of the things that matter to you as well. Yes. Okay. Do. So did you bring, I know you brought some favorite pieces. Can you talk about some of the details? A favorite. <laughs> I, 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 um, so, so yeah. yeah, and different looks too. So tell me about some of the pieces that you have. Sure. That you brought. So we have um, bralettes and bras, underwears, and then robes, slips, so many different pieces. Okay. We actually can make trillions of different designs with what we have. So here's a robe. This is our long robe. It also comes in a shorter version. Okay. 50 different fabrics to choose from, and every part of the garment can be changed into a different fabric. And then we so if you wanted to trim it out with something, or if you just wanted a little color or a little pizzazz, right. you could change that out. Like you so could... literally everything, you can customize everything. Exactly. Yeah, every part of the garment. And if you have a special request, we work one-on-one -on -one with you, too. If you have a certain fabric that's special to you, like your wedding dress that you want to turn into a lingerie, we can also work one-on-one -on -one with really custom pieces. That's yeah. a fabulous idea. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, and what are some of the other looks that you've created? Mm -hmm. Sure, so this is probably our most popular popular design. It's the high-waisted underwear. Okay. It's a little bit retro, but women really like it because it, it always gives you a really good shape. You know, it hugs you in the right places. Lovely. And shape wear that's fun to wear. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> this is um, a bralette. It actually goes with that piece before, and we carry um, bras and, bra and bralettes from size 28A all the way through 40J. It's 70 different bra sizes. What's the difference between a bra and a bralette? Well, a bra... Um, has an underwire okay. to it. So there's a lot of debate about whether or not that's good for you, whether or not it's comfortable, um, and most bralettes are typically in sizes small or extra small through large or extra large. So it's not normally going to give you as much support as ours will. So pairing a band size with a cup size will give you a firm fit around your band that will actually create the support you need in whatever size you are. So you don't just have to wear old granny ugly looking things. Right. Who right? wants to do that? No one, not me. <laughs> <laughs> I always like to look pretty. I, you know, and it's funny too because uh, being single, a lot of times I wear lingerie just for myself. Yeah, you know, right. I want something that when I go to bed and I snuggle up underneath my princess pillow that I just <laughs> feel happy, yeah. right? Um, and I like that piece too. What is like an all-in-one piece called? So that looks like it's almost like a jumpsuit type of thing that you have on the mannequin. What is that? Oh, what sure. You, yeah. yeah, that's a romper. Okay. So we have a romper and we also have the long version, which is pants a jumper. Oh, let me see that. That's really cute. Yeah. Okay. Wow. Cinched in at the waist and then long all the way down to and the And like toes. I said, the quality is absolutely yeah. phenomenal. Mm -hmm. This is so great. And you've been sewing since you guys were little girls, right? You've always been creative. Who took the sewing class first? I did. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I'm the, the seamstress. Okay. Um, but we've been creative, yeah, since we were little kids. Music and painting and any kind of art that we could get our hands on. So... Uh, after we graduated college, I took a sewing class and just kind of fell in love, and that's really how it had all started. And so on the website, when somebody goes to the website, 
Do you teach them how, like, how to make the proper measurements and everything? We do, yeah. We have a sizing page that'll show you five different measurements okay. to take. There's two for your band size and then three for your bus size. And with those measurements, we have a calculator on our website that'll show you what your bra size is or what your closest bra size is and a good starting place for you. How accurate are you? Because I know you've done thousands of orders now. Are you pretty much true to form? Like, has there anybody that's returned it and said, ah, oh, it doesn't fit at all? And, and do you make adjustments for them? We do. We actually okay. have a really great policy, which is a remake policy. So okay. anything that you place and doesn't fit you or you don't like the color, there's something about it, we'll remake it to your exact specifications. So we do have people that um, get bras. It's mostly around the bras that are really difficult to fit. So when they send it back in, we'll remake it in whatever size and ship it right back out. Or sometimes if somebody gets a fabric that they didn't realize exactly what the color was or they're not so happy with the way that the two fabrics interacted with each other, we'll remake that as well. So even if it's not a fit issue, even if it's just a personal preference, we're happy to get a happy customer. Yeah. And I know that you work with a lot of brides, right? Mm -hmm. Where they're, they're ordering their whole set. It's almost like a, a shower, if you will, where their exactly. girlfriends are getting together and they're buying all of their intimates for them, yeah. which is kind of cool. What a great, fun idea is that? Yeah, right? mm -hmm. so, we do um, parties for okay. um, either bachelorette parties or bridal parties. We'll sometimes have a big party where all the girls will get to design something and sometimes it's a gift from the bride or sometimes it's a gift from the bridal party to the bride. Um, we also do parties just locally. We do trunk shows. Um, if there's a special event or ladies night that you want to do, we're happy to, you know, have a big shebang. and. Yeah. <laughs> bring some wine and have fun. <laughs> and, and in the growth of your overall company, one of the things that you had talked about at the launch pad uh, during the pitch night is that you're looking for not any investor, but specific types of investors that you would be willing to partner with because you're really growing this brand in a huge way. Um, are there certain things on your wish list that, that you're looking for in particular? What would be helpful? Um, you know, I, I don't think we're quite there yet. Okay. We're starting to move the wheels, heading in that direction. Um, right now, we just want to present our company in the best way possible. So that really means kind of tightening up any, you know, loose ends that we have. Okay. And solidifying where we are so that we are viable when we go look for investors. Well, that's important, too, because one of the things that Harley Davidson, I don't know if you know the history of their brand, but one of the things that they did is that they, in the beginning, they weren't charging enough for their bikes, and mm -hmm. everybody wanted to order them, but they couldn't keep up with the demand. Mm -hmm. And I learned about that uh, when I was studying advertising, and I said, oh, yeah, I get it. You want to make sure that all your infrastructure is in place. And you've worked exactly. with big retailers before, right, right? behind yeah. the scenes, but now this is your own company that you're going to be able to take early. Right. big and on a grand scale. And in the meantime, the customer service is in place. Yes. The quality of your products in place. You mm -hmm. have a lot to celebrate. I was so impressed when I met you that I was like, oh. Lee. I'm like, I got to know these girls and I've made a <laughs> beeline for you. Oh. Um, and your work is lovely. It's just Thank you absolutely so much. the Thanks. best of the best. Is there one success story? Is there something that you could share when somebody came to you and said, wow, you changed their life because you worked with them? Can you share that story with us? Okay. Yeah, we've definitely had many women come to us. A lot of times it's women who don't know where to find bras in their size. So that's really something that is important for us because the struggle is real. <laughs> so Noelle and I, we're, um, we are sisters and we both have very different sizes. And we have both struggled to find bras in our correct sizes. And I wouldn't say that we're, you know, on either end of the extreme. We're fairly, you know, in the middle somewhere. And we're still struggling to find bras that really work for us, that really last, that really support us in the way that we need to be supported. So we have, um, actually recently we had a woman come to us and she said I practically cried when I found your website because I have never had a bra that has fit me well and I have never felt comfortable in a bra and so that was really touching for us and it's something that we can relate to and I'm sure most women can relate to you know having that one bra that is the one bra that works right. is the one that you wear every single day and it doesn't have to be that way you know you can have a whole variety in every different color of exactly what you want and exactly what fits. And a lot of times, too, there, there's two other uh, groups that I know that you work with, and a lot of times people are not uh, proportionate. They're, they're, they're a little uneven, but only slightly. 
right? So they might be an A on one side, a B on one side, and, and you work with them, as well as mastectomy patients. A lot of times people now are not having reconstruction immediately or, or at all, right? Right, And they're choosing mm -hmm. to still have beautiful lingerie, to still feel beautiful and empowered about their body. And that's mm -hmm. where I know that your bralettes have come in handy for many, many women. So yes. congratulations to you guys. So, so it's just impishly, right? Yeah, impishly. Impishly. And we actually have a code just for you. Okay. It is Donna. Oh. So if anybody <laughs> wants to get 20% off their first order, you can enter Donna into your checkout page and enjoy 20% off on us. That's really nice. And soon it'll be a whole, what do we say, a live it up line of lingerie, right? Yeah, yeah that's that's Donna. Donna. by Donna Drake. So, you should. Uh, yeah. Stay tuned for more. We hope that you enjoyed uh, watching this segment. We hope if it could be helpful to you that you'll reach out to them. Thank you for watching Live It Up.